Hello everyone and welcome back to Wildcraft! I have to be a little bit quiet right now because we are out in a little bit of a dangerous situation here where it is, well, very beautiful, but it is nighttime and we are in, well, a pretty lush area. I have seen some mobs going around, especially a skeleton with an enchanted bow. So I am a little bit hesitantly cautious to move around. But yes, hello everyone and welcome back. I'm so excited to be here. We're kind of looking for a feather right now, actually, so we can make a, uh, a book and quill, aka our to-do list. But we are also working on a strainer and some brown concrete. Uh, as well as finding a cyan flower. Now, for, for getting a feather, unfortunately it seems like we have to actually <sighs> um, kill a chicken, a chicken uh, unfortunately, which is not really the best, the, the most fun thing. Maybe these turkeys will give some? They kind of look like turkeys at least. Oh, I feel bad for killing them, though. But there we go. We have a feather. It was a turkey. But we have a feather for our book. We really need to find a better way of um, getting feathers like that. Oh, gosh. Okay. Oh, gosh. A little bit of lag there. Okay. Is that a... What the heck kind of creeper is that? Wait, is this a bamboo creeper? Are you friendly? Oh my gosh! <laughs> what are you? Look at you! You're adorable! Oh, you guys, I would love to have like a bamboo forest with these things. What in the heck is this? <laughs> That's really cute, actually. Uh... Thought it was gonna explode on me. Oh, they're everywhere! That is adorable. What are you? Oh, a boar. Nope, don't want to deal with that. Don't want to mess with that. Well, I'm really, really sorry. Uh, did you guys see that? Um. Oh my gosh. Well, there's a drowned. Holy hackers. <laughs> There's a drown, but I feel like I saw some, um, a very big fish somewhere. Yeah, I'm not quite sure I want to go into that water anymore. Well, we are heading home anywho. Although we do need a cyan flower. If only I could find a cyan flower. Maybe we'll keep going a little bit. These, uh, these little bamboo creepers are actually really cute. So we'll keep going. Oh my gosh. A little bit scary though. Um, sometimes. <laughs> but yes, we need some cyan flowers. So we'll keep going, see what the next biome is. And uh, maybe we find a cyan flower there. Possibly. We also need to make some concrete. Uh, so we can make a... A botany pot where we can actually grow our bamboo and sugarcane and such. So that would be pretty darn nice to have. What is this? This is some raspberries. Um, well, we're in a new forest now. The kite bridges? Uh, gotta wait for it to load in a little bit here. A pretty cool area. Oh, what is this? Okay, well, it doesn't look like I can get any. There's a creature of some kind. Hmm. So, unfortunately, it looks like we're not... Oh! Oh gosh, uh, sorry. <laughs> I really do get very focused, huh, when I when I fight. But uh, it seems like we actually 
our shield is kind of breaking, which is unfortunate. Let's uh, let's cross over here. There we go. Yeah, you're not getting a zombie. There we go. Oh my gosh. Okay, well that creeper got us. <laughs> I thought it was only the bamboo creeper, creepers here. Well, that's my bad. Whoops. Uh, well, yeah, we need to find like a cyan tulip or something along the lines of that. But uh, it doesn't really look like we are going to. Maybe actually in the birch forest. Oh, actually, I think I have seen like cyan flowers in the birch regions. Yeah, see, there's these blue ones. Now, I think, unfortunately, they give light blue. Which is not what we want. A yeah, cornflower. Oh, it's just blue dye in, in general. Oh my gosh. Well, here comes the zombies and the creepers. There's a little bit of lag that's just... Be well, there's a lot of lag, let's be honest. <laughs> but that's simply just because we, um, we're in a new area. It'll go away eventually. Um, it's just when the game loads in all these chunks, it uh, kind of takes a little, a little extra. Uh, now, cyan dye can also be made with green dye, so you know, that's a way to do it, I suppose. Um. So we could possibly also find some, uh, what's it called, tomato vines. Uh, this is a pretty cool area though. Wait, hold on, is that horsetail? Because that was another one. It, it Yeah, it's horseweed. Okay, there we go. So we can actually grow green, green dye with this. And we can even grow it like this. Yes! Yes! Because look at this. Cyan dye could be made from green and blue. Then we did it. Okay, well, let's head home again then. We got a feather for our book. We have a bamboo to actually get the leather for our book. <laughs> And we have green dye, as well as cyan now. Oh, that's wonderful. Okay, well, let's do one of each like that. And then we'll we'll grow... Um, this horse weed will actually grow. And we needed exactly two cyan dye, so that is absolutely wonderful. That's perfect! And then when we get, find Sky, our puppy, then we can actually, you know... <laughs> Keep her, because she'll have a bed. Yes! Oh, okay, well, this went, this went surprisingly well. And we are getting our botany plots, so we can actually, you know, start growing things. Also, I need a brown dye. Right, I need brown dye for this. Is this a brown mushroom, or is it... No. Oh. Oh, yes! Soybean! That is perfect! <laughs> Soybeans are amazing! Because, as I said, I'm, I'm a vegetarian um, in real life, so I'll kind of be, uh, be using that in this game as well. But soybeans are absolutely lovely, because you can make tofu! Absolutely perfect. Man, well, this was a really good a sort of uh, little travel here. I'm going to try to, uh, we're going to try heading back along this path so that we don't uh, get little holes in our map. <laughs> oh yeah, and actually I wanted to kind of check this area out as well. Uh, it's like a uh, drip stone area. So we're going to go over there, I think. I still need to find... Oh, was this? Yes, we can use brown dye for that. Okay. And I can't, I can't really, unfortunately, right, that would be cocoa beans, I guess. It would be a way, or mud. Cocoa beans and mud. Well, cocoa beans is the only one that's a replenishable source. Uh, so that's probably what we have to aim for, but I don't think there's any cocoa stuff here. 
Oh, and finally I don't have to kill the chickens anymore. <laughs> oh, I, I, I need to figure out how to get feathers from the chickens uh, without, you know, killing them. I need to figure something out there. What is this biome? Oh, it's the same that was over there. Okay. That makes sense. Well, then hopefully we, all we need now is a little bit of iron. Uh, well, luck with iron. And we actually got a lot of our stuff done. Well, this was a productive episode already. How wonderful. Um, well, there is water. I'm gonna get this sugar cane as well. There's water. I don't really like diving down into deep, uh, deep parts of water <laughs> when I can avoid it. So I would rather just avoid it. <laughs> there we go. This area is okay. But uh, that area over there is just not my thing. Okay, so the deep slate thing... Or no, the dripstone, sorry. Should be right over here. Gosh, okay, yeah, here it is. Oh, oh no. Uh-uh. My thalassophobia... See, I can't even talk. <laughs> My thalassophobia said no to that. I can... I can... Uh, Vouch for that. <laughs> nope, nope. Don't want anything to do with such things. Okay, well, I guess we just jump down via this thing. I don't really see that much iron. There's some there, though. Oh, gosh. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, my goodness. Uh, a lot of uh, stalagmites down here there we go i will always remember the day i learned whether uh, it was a stalagmite or a stalactite and um a lot of you might know where i learned that from <laughs> there we go i actually don't have any food with me oh no we have sweet berries we're good there we go. See, and all this iron. Oh, this is wonderful. The surface iron right here. And we actually have that huge mine to go into as well at some point. Uh, although that's not right now, I don't think. But yeah, we found like a huge mine shaft not that many episodes ago. That was pretty fun. There we go. And even more iron. Well, we have just solved all our problems, it seems. There we go. Uh, for now, of course. It, it, we are actually using quite a lot of iron as well, so... Unfortunately, this uh, batch won't hold for too long, I'm, I'm afraid. Um... There we go. Now this is a little bit creepier. <laughs> with the um with everything going on, but there is some iron behind here, so yes, thank you. I would love to get that. And there's one left. Boom. There we go. Man, we already have almost half a stack of iron. There we go. No, oh, never mind. I got too excited. <laughs> and we have zombies. Oh, well, whoa. Okay, well, he must have fallen down somewhere. Because he was he was not very strong. <laughs> that was a little bit um, underwhelming, I suppose. Oh, skeleton, though. Skeletons are a little bit tougher. Ow. Okay, well, we made it. And I picked up some rocks, apparently. Well, it doesn't look like there's any more iron down here, so let's pack up our things and go home, I think. Oh, no, there's some more iron up there. Oh, and behind here. You little sneaky, you tried to hide from me. <laughs> 
It's kind of difficult finding iron with all the dripstone around, apparently. I hadn't even thought about that. Well, I didn't think it would be an issue, at least. I wonder what dripstone actually... Oh, gosh. <laughs> I wonder what dripstone actually does, what you can use it for. There we go. Oh, okay. Well, our, our pickaxe is done, so I suppose that means we are done as well. We got 45 uh, ingots, though. Well, they're not ingots right, uh, right now. It's raw iron for now, but we got 45 iron. That is pretty good. Also, I didn't know stalactites or stalagmites <laughs> um, actually hurt you if you landed on them, although that does does actually make a lot of sense. Is there any more iron down here? I could imagine, but uh, right now it doesn't look like it. I can't pick it up anyway, so I would just be sad if I found more. <laughs> there we go. And let's head home, finally. And hopefully find Sky. <laughs> Because I want her with us on all these adventures. It's so sad that she can't be here. Because she's off doing her own thing somewhere. I don't know what that block is, but... Um... Oh gosh. There we go. Okay, well, some bison have fallen down here, it seems. That's not too great. That's a little bit sad, and their friends are just kind of watching from above. Oh, okay. That was quite fulfilling. Very, very fulfilling. Actually, we need some food as well, speaking of fulfilling. <laughs> we don't really have any food to... Uh... Um, to eat. At home. Uh, is what I'm saying. Okay, now where is home? I suppose we just run at this point? Uh, this is the swamp, so we are pretty close to home. We just need to go into the uh, forest over here, the larger forest. Oh gosh. Okay, well here's a drop and a half. There we go, this old old growth. Into the old growth, and then we're almost home. In fact, we can see it on the map now. Ooh, I'm gonna pass that. <laughs> oh gosh, there's a baby zombie after us as well. Oh gosh! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, it's happening again. Oh, we're almost home. We can do this. No! 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 <laughs> Why? And now we are in a raid. <laughs> and we can't sleep. Oh my gosh. Sir, please stop. Stop. I'm gonna move this. I'm sorry, sir. I'm gonna barricade myself in here. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, the lions are apparently taking care of the raid. Um, or cougar? Is that a cougar? Mountain lion? I'm unsure. Wow. Okay, well, we were very close to home. Look at this. Look at this silliness. We were right there. <laughs> and now we're up here again. Oh gosh. Well, that's okay. Uh... I think I really want to sleep, but, you know, it seems like they don't want me to. Oh, there we go, finally. My goodness. And there is a zombie killing everyone. You know, maybe uh, we should build our own village. <laughs> Save these poor things. Because they really, they really have a lot going on for them here. Oh, and actually, maybe we should get a cat. Although I don't think, maybe I shouldn't get a cat before I even get my own dog back. That seems a little bit weird. 
Uh, hmm. Let's let's uh try to get out of here, I suppose. I'll put this back right here. Okay, well now we can't because there's a cougar or mountain lion in front of us. Oh my gosh! Okay, so apparently they can open doors. And I'm hesitant to actually respawn now, because I have a feeling that he's still there. You know? Um... Yeah. Okay. Well, that makes everything a little bit more complicated, of course. If I have enough lives, maybe I can stop. <laughs> stop. Get away. Yes, I didn't. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um okay, well, I'll I don't need all this. And uh, maybe I should steal this bed. No, we'll just we'll just run. 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 Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, oh my gosh, there's a skeleton. Oh, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. I'm sorry, kitty. I'm sorry. I don't mean to scare you. Oh my gosh. And there's the beautiful giraffes. And there's more monsters. <laughs> okay, we gotta get home. We gotta get home. This is ridiculous. My goodness gracious. If we don't have any food, we're all alone. <laughs> What is that? It's a raccoon! Oh, that's so cute! Oh, and there's another one! Okay, well, I actually really want to... Oh, a raccoon exhibit? Well, habitat? That Oh, that would be really cool to make. Um, Maybe you could even make that, like, next to a house. Or, like, make a little tiny abandoned house. Like a raccoon building. <laughs> that would be kind of cute. Oh, like an actual house, but uh, the entire interior is just full of things they can climb on and such. And, like broken couches and things. Oh, we're almost home now. Well, I definitely recognize this. There we go. Finally. My gosh. And there's a boar. I really don't want to mess with any more boars or anything anymore. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Ah, my goodness. If only... If only we had Sky with us. <laughs> she could have saved, of, saved us from that skeleton. And then none of this would have happened. Well, here's some plums. That's okay, though. It's, uh, it's good to have some experiences in life. <laughs> Although I suppose it would only really work in uh, Minecraft like this. There we go. And here we are. Boom. Wonderful. <laughs> now let's walk through this lovely forest. Pick a little bit of hazelnuts. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, how lovely. And let's walk just 10 more steps and here is our house. <laughs> oh, and look at how lovely it looks. Oh, I'm really loving this house, actually. Oh, to be home again. Well, with all the things we've gathered, we sure do have a lot of things to do uh, in the next episode. And... My goodness, do I look forward to that. Hold on, there we go. Do I look forward to that? <laughs> but this was quite the event, you guys. And if you guys do want to see more of this stuff, because, my goodness, we will have more adventures and silly things like this happen, I believe, then please do consider subscribing and maybe even join us on our other adventures here on the channel. But until next time, you guys, bye-bye!